Hey, what's going on? Rakeem Madison here, and on today's video, I'm going to be teaching you how to increase traffic to your website for free. This is literally a simple but effective method that's not going to cost you a single penny. So pay attention to what I'm going to be sharing with you here, and we'll jump right into the content. All right, now if this is your first time here, go ahead and smash that subscribe button if you want to learn how to build a long, sustainable business that will eventually give you the freedom you deserve. Also, tick that bell icon so that anytime I release any new videos, you get them. All right, so with that being said, we're going to jump right into the content. So here on my channel, I've talked about um, this website that we're gonna that we're gonna be using to generate traffic before, but what I haven't done is I haven't shown you how to actually do so. All right, so that's what we're gonna be doing in this video. So just stick with me to the end. All right, let's get it. All right, so we're gonna be talking about Quora.com today. Now you may have heard of this, maybe you haven't heard of this, but I'm gonna show you how to effectively use this site and generate traffic on your business or your blog or your Shopify. So it does not matter what it is, right? You're gonna be able to generate traffic here on this platform, all right? So first things first, Quora is a question and answer website. So there's people all day, either you're gonna be the one asking a question or you're gonna be the one answering someone else's question while providing value, all right? So um, to show you the amount of traffic that you have the possibilities of generating, right? And you can generate more, but I just wanna show you using my profile. So I'll go over to my profile. And as you can see right here, I wanna point this out automatically. 3,900 answer views, all right? So that's a total of 3,000 eyes on the questions that I'm answering, all right? And then if we go right here, for this month so far, I generated 728 eyes on the, the questions that I've answered, right? So let me actually scroll down and give you an idea of you know how many how many eyes you may get on one single post, um, how many upvotes you can get because what Cora does is, is is if you like um, the answer that someone has given, you have the ability to go ahead and upvote that or downvote it, right? So it's like a like or a dislike, right? So if I if I continue to scroll down, I want to actually take you back to when I first got started doing this, right? It was a little bit ago. Uh, let's go to my first question, right? So someone asks, "What is CPA marketing?" Right? So I went in and I gave some value, right? Um, my my first question, it, it didn't get any upvotes. My second didn't get any upvotes, right? But as we continue to go on, I want you to look at the amount of views, all right? So I'm going to click more, and you'll see this has 258 eyes that went to this. Now, how many of those 258 eyes do you actually think went to this link right here right so i was talking about cpa marketing so what did i do i created a video explaining what is cpa marketing right so i if you click on this link right here it's going to take you over to that video that i did on cpa marketing you see how easy this can be hey what's going on on there and i and i made this this video is actually unlisted it's not publicly on my channel Right. Um, but I did it specifically for this because I want to see um, the amount of traffic it was going to drive. Now, um, based on the statistics, if you look here, 258 people, uh, 258 people came to this post, but only 11 views. Right. So there's still some potential with that. Now, let's keep going. All right. Let's keep going to the next one. Let's look for one that actually has upvotes. OK. Someone asks, is it possible to start a business when you have a full-time job? Now, I specifically did a video on this before I saw this post, right? So what, what do you think I did? I went in and I, I started searching for questions that were based around videos that I already had or that I had a plan on making, right? So since I had already had a video out about this, I went ahead and provided value first through text, right? I gave them some tips right through the text i said yes it is very possible to build your online business around your full-time job and i will give you 10 tips on how to get that done now what i did is for the people that enjoy reading um i put out the tips here and then i said um at the end let me let me actually show you what i did i said 
Um, I hope you get value from this information. If you want a more detailed answer, then go over to my YouTube video where I go more in depth over this specific topic and drop me a comment letting me know if you got value, right? So let's actually go over to that video, right? Let's click right here. So I linked it up and you can see this has 325 views, um, four upvotes, all right? And then let's click on it and let's see the engagement and the views on this. All right, give it a second. It's taking a little bit longer than expected. Need a crappy drawing of a pink bird thing? All right, so check it out, guys. 6,529 views, 119 likes, and two dislikes. Check it out, guys. Just the strategy alone. You see what I mean? So and there's only 325 views that went there, but there's 6,000 views. Now, of course... Um, I understand YouTube SEO and how to get tr how to drive traffic there. So not all I'm not saying all of the views came from this, but I'm sure a good majority of those views came from this specific this specific post. All right, so let's keep going. Let's look for some more uh, up upvotes. Uh, let's see here. Um, I'm not gonna really go for that one. Uh, I think I had a, a real good example for one, right? Where I, where I use my method where I say you want to give value first and then send them somewhere. All right, so let's keep going until I find it. Uh, let's see here. Okay, so this one, right? Someone said, my friend and I run a YouTube channel called The Morning Review. It's not getting subs anymore, and I think we are doing it mostly right. What are we doing wrong? Right. So what I did is I found that question. Right. I was just scrolling down my timeline and I was like, OK, I can give value to this person. Right. And it looks like what I did is I actually went over to their channel. Right. I clicked the link that he provided here. This is actually his channel link. And I, I took a look at it because he was trying to figure out what, what are they doing wrong. So when I went over to his channel, what I noticed and I might as well just go to go over to his channel now. Let's see if he if he changed it up a little bit and made it a little better. Okay, I can definitely see he has more subscribers uh, since last time. Um, let me actually go to his videos. And uh, give me a second. All right, so it's going over to his videos. So now what I watched, what, what, I, what I noticed when I went over to his channel, I was like, okay, let's look what it is that I noticed that he's not doing, right? So if I keep scrolling down here, you see, uh, you'll start to see different reviews, right? So Dr. Pepper Bites review, right? And then let, let's keep going. Quid app review, Peeps review, right? So it looks like now he's sticking to doing like, like different foods, right? Now that may just be the route that he wants to go, but that's the first thing I noticed. And then I noticed he had another, uh, more videos like this. So I made a hole in my wall. And you can see that has nine views over uh, four weeks time. Now, view that like videos like this, they're not going to drive mass, a massive amount of views unless you're like some type of influencer or someone, someone who does vlogs on a consistent basis. But if you use keyword research, and this is what I was trying to explain to him uh, within this post, right? And like I said, his, his subscribers have definitely increased. So he's starting to implement it more. But I can assume that he's probably using what I showed him, right? Now, I want you to check this out. And this creates engagement not only on here, but it can also increase your subscribers on YouTube. All right, so let's go back to it. So I said, so I took a look uh, over your channel, your guy, you guys' channel. And here are the things I noticed, right? So I talked, just as I told you before, I told him, this is a review channel. Yes, I get that but it's not targeted to what type of reviews that you're going to be doing. So then I, I came next. I said, okay, not sure if you are, but you want to use, not sure if you are, but you want to use YouTube auto suggest to figure out what people are actually searching for. So I talk about this here a lot on this channel. Like you don't want to be creating videos around things that people are not searching for. That means you're going to get 10 views right after a six month span and i'm just being completely honest unless of course you're an influencer okay and then i ended and i said keyword research is very vital to a review type channel here is a video where i show my exact strategy on how to do keyword research and then boom you see my youtube video i basically linked it up right there 
and now let's take a look at the views so that's 152 views and I have two upvotes and I also have some comments as well so you see this person referred this uh, they, they made this message to everyone they said thanks everybody for answering my questions I'll try to consolidate my content um, to a specific theme and start marketing better now let's look at all of, all of what uh, let's look at what everyone said right so you see someone else commented they said exactly what I was thinking when I watched didn't know about keyword research but that's good advice right so that's someone else right because they they didn't just they didn't ask me specifically this question someone else on that post that saw my video watched it got value and guess what else I ended up having that same person who I answered the question for ended up subscribing to my channel and also this person right here also ended up subscribing to my channel so what what did what did I do there I provided value on the front end right through the through the given text of what the the site actually allows you to do so I use the word and then I, I sent them somewhere after providing value because if I provide enough value within the words they're most not nine times out of ten they're gonna go and watch this video right and that's what I want you to understand and I and I do it multiple times I, I do it like 50% I don't put a link in every uh, answer that I give on here but I do put a link in 50% alright so let's let's try to find another example um let's see if I put a link in this one okay so this is an example where I just put brought people to my channel so I said they, they asked what traffic sources do you prefer to run affiliate offers so the best way I felt that I could give value is to separate them and what type of platforms you should use for specific uh, offers I said okay affiliate offers from offer vault max bounty JV zoo and ETC you can do organic YouTube ranking also being advertising should be used for these offers for the best results then I said network marketing offers affiliate marketing hybrids you can use Facebook YouTube ads and organic YouTube ranking as well and then this is how I give the call to action this is how you get them to go over to whatever website you want them to go you say I put together a powerful being ads training here on my YouTube channel be sure to check it out by clicking below now check it out this has 61 views and it has two upvotes so two people liked it uh, the answer I gave so how many other people do you think that if, if, if people are upvoting it nine times out of ten someone is going to go and click the link to go over to my channel right so boom when they click that they're going to my home channel on YouTube so now not only do they know that I have a, a powerful being as training they know that I have a you know a, a, an authoritative channel that has you know at this point I want to say at the time they're watching this I have uh, 1247 subscribers right so they go over there and they see more value more videos they're gonna be like oh man this this guy has you know not only does he have a, a powerful being gas training but he has some pretty valuable content here on his channel right so that is really it guys that's that's really all we're doing here right now let me actually go this is actually my profile and as you can see what they allow you to do right so you see I have a nice picture here it looks pr pretty professional um, I have my name uh, I have you know that I'm a YouTube SEO expert online marketing expert and internet marketer right and then they give you the ability to create a small bio and then what I what I what I would do is I would send people who want to do what I would I do to this link right here so when they go here guess what they're going to be sent to a capture page this is a capture page to a business that I currently promote right so I can also generate traffic through my business from here all right so let's go back and then you see I have hundred and seventeen followers here on this platform and then they allow you to put your credentials over here so um, as you can see um, I'm certified in security plus um, and then the founder at marketing mastermind so that's actually a company that I created all right so it's just it allows you to put yourself out there um, and then like to put yourself out there as far as you know on a professional side as well as if you just want to be someone who provides massive value to people by answering their questions and then making sure value first send them somewhere last alright so remember that and you'll be fine my friend so I hope that you got some value from this video and if you did go ahead and give me a thumbs up also 
Make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Tick that bell icon to be notified. And I look forward to seeing you in the next video, my friend. Peace.